Today's video is very interesting. Yes, it is about Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. Yes, it is about all of the cameos that we've either heard rumored or leaked to be involved in this already gigantic and insane film. But the information we're getting today is a quote coming from somebody very big in Marvel's universe. It's actually the creator of Deadpool. Rob Liefeld, who claims he's seen screeners for Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness, and even goes as far to confirm some of the cameos are happening. We're going to talk about exactly what he said and what it means, and then of course a little bit of speculation as to which of these characters it is that he's talking about. Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back again to Cosmic Culture, the channel where we talk about all major movie and television news, theories, breakdowns, and much, much more. If you haven't already, consider becoming a part of the community, subscribing to the channel, and turning on that notification bell, and say hi in the comment section down below. I'd love to get to know who's out here watching the videos, and let me know your crazy theories for Doctor Strange as well. So Rob Liefeld, the creator of my favorite and many others favorite superhero, anti-villain, Merc with a mouth, Deadpool, has a very important conversation on The Big Thing, which is a YouTube podcast. Now he's on here and they're talking about Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. Just to get to the big point here, because I know you all want to know, he confirms that he knows certain cameos are happening and he gets even more detailed than that but he starts off by saying here's the deal you all know i want to know have either of you been caught trying to sneak into a screening of doctor strange 2 they are testing the movie the thing is they're testing it and it's all getting out we are all guilty of hitting those hashtags there's always the one guy because here's how i know so the interview is kind of chopped up and doesn't necessarily have a really good flow, but what's happening here is they're talking to him about whether or not he's seen any of the screeners for Multiverse of Madness. And he responds saying, yeah, I have. I've actually been really desperate to see them. I've even snuck in or tried to see them any way I can. And yeah, the information is getting out there. There's always that one guy who has to say, yeah, I know because I've already seen the movie, which is just a huge spoiler. Well, it turns out he's also going to be that guy and definitely spoiler warning for anybody who wants to avoid any action facts because this is a guy who works with Marvel who's saying he's seen a screener and then goes on and says this you want me to see it six times you bring some of that Fox Marvel stuff in and actually I know on some level some of it is already there I just have revoked every every one of my Marvel passes just got revoked he says that as a little bit of a joke because obviously he has some information being somebody who has created a character who exists in the Fox universe and he's hinting at us here, yes, in Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness you are going to be seeing some Fox characters. For me, this is actually really, really big. Here's a guy who created Deadpool, a Fox character, who has been rumored with many other Fox Marvel characters to be showing up in Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. You would think he knows whether or not Deadpool is going to show up in Multiverse of Madness, how he's going to make it into the MCU. You would even assume he has some type of say as to how that would happen. He created this character and he's sitting here saying, I know on some level it's already there. And he's kind of joking saying, haha, I'm going to get in trouble with Marvel. They're going to revoke all of my passes. I'm not going to be able to see anything anymore. But there has to be some level of truth to this statement that is coming from Deadpool's creator about the Fox characters because I find it so hard to believe that he wouldn't to some level know. And he's here being very casual and potentially too casual with what he does know in sharing with us that, yeah, some of these Fox Marvel characters are headed into the MCU in Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. Now, that's big. And we've been talking about some of these possible cameos for quite some time, namely through Hugh Jackman playing Wolverine and Patrick Stewart playing Professor X. There is the idea that the Illuminati, which is going to be retconned in the MCU to be playing a group of characters protecting the multiverse, is going to exist. The Illuminati is made up of the heads of every major group like the X-Men, the Avengers, Doctor Strange on the mythical side, you have the Inhumans represented there, and the Fantastic Four, all showing up into this very elite group that is meant to be protectors. And in the comics, they even each take an Infinity Stone and protect the Infinity Stones and protect the universe from that. However, it might be manipulated a little bit here that this group has one character from every realm in protecting and representing the multiverse. And that's where we're going to get to see Professor X, a version of Mr. Fantastic, a version of Iron Man, which has been rumored to be Tony Stark. 
played by Tom Cruise. So many of these different cameo rumors that do make sense if you really line them up, and yeah, it can get overwhelming. But when you hear from an actual creator over at Marvel who's created an iconic character in the Fox universe who we know is going to be making a transition over to the MCU, say, I know on some level it's already here in reference to the Fox Marvel characters and how they need to be in Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness to really get people excited. Those are a lot of very important flags that should start be shooting up because Deadpool's got to make it over. Ryan Reynolds is working on Deadpool 3 in the MCU. That character is going to make it over. Now, there have been rumors that we're going to be seeing a version of Deadpool Kills the Marvel Universe, which is my favorite comic book of all time, but that it would be Deadpool Kills the Fox Universe. And that's a really fun idea. If you're familiar with Deadpool Kills the Marvel Universe at all, he really literally goes through and does exactly what the title says, killing all of the characters in the Marvel Universe because he's gotten this enlightenment that they're just a bunch of comic book characters. He kills everybody, and it's a very intense comic. But he could do something similar to this in the Fox universe, where he realizes the MCU is the sacred timeline, the better timeline, and he destroys the Fox universe and makes his way over to the MCU. That's a huge rumor that we're hearing about how Deadpool's gonna make his way into the MCU officially. But that means maybe we'll be getting a Deadpool cameo in Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness, and this will be where he realizes, perhaps, that the sacred timeline is better than the off-branded Fox timeline that's not as good, and he's going to make his way over in his movie based off the information that he's going to get in Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. Now, this is obviously some crazy speculation coming from a very intimate and important quote coming from the mouth of the creator of Deadpool who says he knows what's going on with some of the Fox characters to some level. And I definitely think it's something worth paying attention to. If you were already doubting a little bit all of these cameos we've been talking about, this is more reason to believe we're getting something. Do I think we're gonna get every single cameo that's been rumored? No, I don't think the movie's long enough. I don't think there's enough time. Although it's possible we can open a portal and close a portal in a snap of a finger and that was a cameo all done. And not every single one of these characters are gonna be permanent. Not every single one of them is gonna have significant screen time or be significant characters even the film. But it sounds like for sure we should be expecting some Fox Marvel characters making their way into Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. This is further evidence of that. Not only A, does it make perfect sense, B, we have some confirmation coming from somebody who should know. But let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section down below. Do you think that, yeah, this is pretty telling evidence that we should be expecting some of these Fox characters to make cameos in Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. Thank you guys so much for watching till the very end of the video. If you found it helpful, useful, or interesting, consider subscribing. And I'll see you guys all in the next one right here on Cosmic Culture.